longtime friend of mine as well. McConnell's been making some of these spoons. He made one for the event specifically for us. What's beautiful about this food is not only that it's orange and it's translucent, you can see through it, but also he's got the double butterfly fan attached. It's a beautiful board. It's a great collector's item. It could also be it could also be written. Okay. We're gonna start this bit off at four hundred dollars. He's gonna give me four hundred for this orange spoon. Beautiful, beautiful orange spoon. How long? Carl, how long is this spoon? Eight. Seven. Five foot. Yep. 400. 400. Check it out. Wayne, this would look great in your office. Talk to your wife. Handle it. This is going to be $550. Hefe, what do you think of this thing? Check it out. Beautiful, huh? I love it. Seven and a quarter. All right, 725. It's sold. Congratulations. Yay! Malibu, and I'm here at Huntington Beach for the KSUSA National Championship Contest that was here the last couple of days. And uh, while I was here, I picked up this spoon at an auction last night. I've just been admiring the George Reno and the great tradition of spoons, so um, it was an opportunity at the auction and I grabbed it, so um, what's interesting about it to me is that you can get on the spoon and um, the thrust in it. As you see, this fins on this are meant to give you a lot of lift, especially a bigger surf coming into it. And as I talked to the shaper, uh, Connell, he was saying, that you take that first turn and it just propels you into the way. So I look forward to that. There's no leash, so take note. Probably more swimming will be involved. Um, but it's exciting, sort of taking the deboarding knowledge I have and uh, putting it in a different realm. So I'm going to take it out for the first time right now. So. to be on the board but so it feels so light in the water it feels like you're riding a feather it's really I just I can't wait to to surf it more and on some bigger waves which would be fun 